I'm kind of wondering when we'll get like the like the fuller length title screen. Because this part is cool, but like the main title screen, uh, screen music is just where is it? Yeah, yeah, we're back. Yep. And Hooktail Castle. We yeah, have stepped in a little bit, but didn't manage to get super far. I like I can hear the sound of this guy. Yep. Oh, oh no! They're trying to remember the voices that gave characters. These bones, they remind me of my father. No doubt about it. It's my father! Did you have to say father twice? Dad! <clears throat> um, wait, what's this? My father's clutching some kind of letter, or at least his uh, bones are. What should I do? Should I read it? <laughs> I think I'm going to mention something that <clears throat> I've heard about <laughs> that's got a little bit of discourse. Ahem. I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail. I am stuck and can go no further. I, said, I should note Hooktail's weaknesses for those who follow. The Hooktail cannot tolerate crooked creatures again of F and end with Raw. So, in the original GameCube version, uh, it was talking about crickets. But, um, this has been changed, and apparently it's much more faithful to the original Japanese localization, which, or, like, not localization, Japanese version, which, yeah, frogs was the animal back then. Apparently, changing them into, uh, crickets was, uh, a localization choice that has since been reversed. I'm not particularly, like, of a strong opinion about it either way. And knowing that this is, like, what it was in the original Japanese definitely makes it a lot more, like, I guess softens the blow. I heard that something related to Hooktail's weakness is hidden somewhere in this castle. If it is to have any hope of defeating Hooktail, we must first find whatever that thing is. Honestly, it's all for doom. Fiend will surely use any trick to save herself. Alas, I do not have the strength to keep my writing. Already, it's too pale in my eyes. Last words go to my son. Colorado, I love you, and I'm proud of who you've become. Huh? I said... <laughs> like the music just... I said, Colorado? Not Coops? Oops. Um, yeah, I guess this is my father after all. Colorado is actually a character in the fir uh, first Paper Mario uh, game. He's an archaeologist, and you can probably guess by his name how it's like kind of like a parody of Indiana Jones since he's Colorado, named after a state. Mm -hmm. And he shows up a few times. This is my father. I wonder if that pile of bones over there is my dad. Yeah, like they changed the key colors. The shapes too. You care like to lose all your lives much if you come to disturb come to this castle to disturb us. You will go no farther. And from this moment on, there'll be nothing but bones. Yep. What are you doing? What are you doing? over me, man! What should we do? Another thing is just look at all the things moving and doing stuff.
red, I think. The fashion fence, you know? Make these one, pack is three, fence is one. My driver's double is neutered and counted to zero. Oh, they revived! Like a zombie! If you roll with bell bones, you attack the red bones. One more thing, if your friends start to fall, you may create some more. traditions of mine that I do here is uh, in this battle uh, I use it as a point to farm Doubles, and I literally just farm here. Definitely a very like slow and tedious thing to do, but it's a tradition I do.
over there behind you. Yeah. 30, and the most you can get in battle is enough for a full level up.
there is a, a badge you can get. Oh. Yeah, they like really let you know. Or it seems like stop! Someone has something in the audience. What's up? Something I'm uh noticing. I don't remember them stacking like that before. I remember them just getting longer. Realistically, this is one of the few fights in the game where you actually can just get this many star points. Something! Thank you. 
90. So when you make the next one, I'll just kill them all. Yep, there we go. Would have been a full 100. Red. There is a hard distinction. 
Hey there, boy! I'm so glad you found that key. Unbelievable! Wee hee hee! Fools! I believe it was idiotic pudding brain dope would fall for a scheme like that! That was chops to fetch anyone who's entered this place from ever leaving it! I wish I could take your fans away to a slow, painful end! Oh wait, there's more to this great deal! I've got a free curse! No charge! <laughs> now you're cursed, doofus, and it suits you right. Curses are cursedly cursed more than any curse that ever cursed you. Or, this curse makes you uh, like a piece of paper when you press the whole ZR. <laughs> what a curse! Who curses like me? No one! I shall show you just how frightful that curse it is! Press no ZR now! <laughs> just look at yourself! How embarrassing for you! You'll be all pegged for bed while you press the arm! Don't try to jump or move, but you'll probably just wobble there! Do you understand what this curse means for you? Farewell, you dumbo! <laughs> Turn and we'll walk sideways through bars. Oh, we got like a sound effect. Pack effects G. Right, so like this is the key. Put this on. Yeah, like it's definitely a bit different, but hearing in the original, uh, uh, knowing what the original sound was like. I can get why uh, they might change it to like sound like uh, crickets. I can hear crickets, but also just hearing just like. Never, never, never. So yeah, now we are doubling back for that green key. Like the torn edges, that's like new and different. And like the sound, too. Before it's like whoop, whoop, whoop.
yeah, that star piece over there. I know how to get to it. Yeah, oh yeah, I need to ride the purple block up. Okay, I mean, 
Give me the this crystal star first. Well, he wasn't bad, I would have to. Let you get your crystal star. Um, hey, you guys must be. Yep, no kiss. Like, he's like, whoa. Oh. He's having a safe time out for now, Mr. Sweetie. I know, it's okay. We just met and already said safe farewell. Alive. Oh my, so bold. Is that legal? Oh, at least we got a little stick to share with you. So this guy's loads of badge and hockey best cocktail, that's what I heard. I don't think that it is. You found it already. I did. Maybe not. You're gonna find cocktail. Sweet man fighting that badge first. Oh, I can't catch the mustache man. It's gonna get real soon. Another great pose. I don't want to show you this. I bet it's an interesting one. Full of romance. So well, I don't need any of these things. They're just filling up space in my inventory.
no way to try to like, yeah, you know, like hold it for him to like come back up. So we got jump, drop down here. Oh! This pipe is new! That is a new thing! Because before, you go down, you then have to make your way back up slowly. But there, now they added this extra pipe and platform. Yeah, like the star piece up through here. Don't remember there being yeah, like any any further. Yeah, the badge under the moat. All the stuff in the storage room. I have to come back once I can, uh, can ground pound to get that star piece, but. items. Got both of those. Got that over there. Yep. Got everything there is to find here. Actually. Yep. Shiny sprites again. Theoretically, once I, yeah, turn the star in, I should be able to unlock the sound test.
like you like a break dance thing it makes so much sense. Oh, it's getting darker. Okay, so I'm gonna show off what happens when you do this, but then I'm going to uh, save and quit and reload. Because I usually do this without, because I, I like it that way. Who, who dares approach me? So, like, because we, yeah, we know now that Hooktail is supposed to be a girl. I try to use, like, a deep female voice. Ooh. That's a bit more of, like, a lead up there. Uh, I didn't expect more to come to steal the treasure I protect. That was foolish, I fear. Do you really think you can beat me? You're so slow. They don't appear tasty. Oh, you might be a good snack. If you're dying on the bottom of your feet, I'll say you saute you to crispy goodness and gobble you down head first! Yeah, a much higher attack. That did two. But I kind of like to fight Hooktail without the badge. 
I like to not do an easy mode, so. Now that I've shown the dialogue, we'll reload the save and do it properly. through all the text here. I don't remember them like yeah, kind of like standing up in the dark and walking up into the lights.
this also supposed to like really draw the audience. Because they're already kind of full there. Attack, which bypass by increased defense. that man to stay inside. Huh. You aren't a very trusting fellow, are you? You're going to be able to trust someone, though. Know. Uh, I guess I'd better... Look out, Luigi! Yeah, she literally ate the audience. That's just not right! <laughs> Ah, now my strength has returned to me! I can't go for this! Let's finish this gal off fast, Mario! You pulled it off, Mario. If you just find that crystal star thing, you're looking for. Oh. 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 
I'm out! I'm finally out! Whoa, it... it can't be... Huh? Dad? Well, uh, this is cool. Hey, son, you're growing so big since I saw you last. Oh, yeah, I guess I have, but who cares, Dad? Hey, golly, what happened to you? Where have you been all this time? Oh, well, I gave me a while back to you at Hooktown, and all was well and good. This one went fishing blow. She used the smell from her feet to stun me and then gobble me down the hole. <laughs> the original line was she played a dirty tr uh, trick on me. And is this, I was about to, like, uh, make a joke about just, like, Oh, uh, just like, yeah, like the whole smelling the feet thing. But no, the game made that for me. <laughs> I approve of this change of dialogue. <laughs> she used the smell from her feet to stun me. Yeah. Yeah. Did she offer you to smell her feet? Like she did us? Howdy, Michelle. For 10 years since then, inside Hooktail's belly. How have I not been digested? I don't know. Boy, was it nasty. Yuck. So glad to finally get out. <laughs> yeah, Twitch. Honestly, Dad, I haven't been so worried about you this whole time. Oh, sorry, Dad, but I'm okay. That's right. Good, right? We're together now, right? Hey, speaking of which, what are you do all doing here anyway? Oh, uh, my Dad. Came here to be hooked down. Oh, you're looking for a gem called the Crystal Star. <laughs> so, I was wondering what you're talking about, would it? What's that? <laughs> Found it down there in Hooktail's belly. Nice, huh? We're gonna keep it as a souvenir. <laughs> this thing you've been looking for, you can have it! Huh? <laughs> Come now, don't take no for an answer. You can spread, right? Please take it. Let's see if they up the presentation for getting a Crystal Star. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Crystal Star! Star Pass increases too. Mario also learned the special move, Earth Tremor. You time you get a Crystal Star, you learn a new special move. Oh, uh, it's not end of chapter, come on. This is a magical map they received from Princess Peach. Mario and his friends claim their first Crystal Star. Jack and Hooktail defeated since the Petal Bird would rest easy once again. Hooks even reunited with his long lost father, who he thought was dead. Yet despite victory in the castle, Princess Peach's whereabouts was still unknown. Where could she be? Since Mario's adventure has just begun. Yep. And auto saving. Yep, here we go. Exalted Grotus, we brought the Princess Peach you ordered. We brought the Princess Peach you ordered. Whoa. <laughs> well, 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 my pet. Isn't it about time you told us where the map is? <laughs> Princess Peach. Speak when spoken to. No more than trying to hide it, silly girl. We know you had it. We know this. Trust me, it's very much in your interest to be absolutely honest with us. We ex knots are all ra not all rainbows and lollipops, I assure you. We're quite nasty. Got it, sir. I have news. Report at once. You know that crystal star we thought maybe a hooktail had? Well, somebody, someone nabbed it. What? What did you say? Someone else is after the crystal stars? And they defeated that hooktail creature, you say? Speak, soldier! Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. There's more, too. See, according to the report, 
There was a mustache dude in a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Mario! Excuse me? Mario? No! Yeah, ga, 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 ga. I see. So you know this Mario, do you? Hmm. His school matters not at all. I'll know all about him before long. That I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess Peach back to the holding room. Yes, sir. And men, take good care of Princess Peach, understand? She's not to be harmed. You got it, sir. I tend to go for, like, totally motionless, like, monotone for, like, the X number of Well, Lord Crump, this Mario character has a map. It's highly likely he'll show up where we're hunting for a crystal star, Boggly Woods. Is that a different difference? I think it's like the star we're hunting in the Boggly Woods. We must return there immediately and hasten the search. It must not fail. <laughs> well, that, uh, yeah, sure, Roger Goodness, that, pow, I'm good. Wonder if sending Lord Crump there alone is wise. He is a bit out there. I feel like I may be a little incompetent as an evil organization leader if I only have a single admin under me. X not. I summon you. You rang, dude. I mean, sir. You rang, sir. Gratis, dude. Gratis, sir. Gratis, sir. Shut up. Go get the three shadows over here. Yep. They, yep. Says the shadow sirens is the three shadows. The, the three sh shadows, sir. But they. I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, fool. Go get them. Now. Gotcha. Sound whenever they poke. Our little Grotus has need of us? We arrive without delay. <laughs> Pray tell, did the princess tell you where the map is? <laughs> some poor fool named Mario now has possession of the map. What would have happened if you had kidnapped Princess Peach when you were supposed to? It's my fault, truly. Town Square too many brown eyes. Too many. Besides, you should join by some fool of an old, uh, of an attendant. Such a, oh, fussy fungus. Hey, yeah, I mean, the newest kindness in Mario is still on the map, yes? <laughs> Indeed, that is your duty. Must I remind you? My map is vital to the x not plan. I'll have my men prepare all of the available information on this Mario. For now, hear me, Belda! You three shadows must take care of this troublemaker. <laughs> Sire, I, Belda! So turn to the new seat! Let's get my lovies! Alright, Vivian, come! We got a job to do! <laughs> ah, Vivian! Oh dear, here we go again! Can't believe I'm kidnapped again! Everyone was being worried sick again. But hang on a moment. Where in the world am I anyway? It's so unfamiliar. I wish you at least let Mario know that I've been caught. Bathroom. 
Oh, that's actually cool looking at my, like, reflection. I love the shower. The soap's gonna be even. Wow, I wonder if it works. Yep, this is a first party Nintendo game where we're literally watching Princess Peach take a shower. <laughs> I think I made a, was over it, but I think uh, you can actually hear her like hum like notes of a tune. Yep, and her hair is up. Glad they kept that feature. How refreshing. I feel like a new princess. Yep, so she's technically got like a ponytail now. Look how she scrubbed and sparkled clean. How oddly considerate of them. Wow, someone did a third job cleaning this. I love how out of place, like, all that bathroom stuff is. Let's try a robot voice. Let's try something. A cool voice. Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? What? Who said that? Where are you? Hello, <laughs> music. Stay right here. Before your eyes. I am this laboratory's main computer. I am the TECXX. Many call me Tech. You may. The girl has created me to be a perfect computer, one that is flawless in its reason. Wait, she's that awful dome-headed thing you interrogated me, right? So Gross is not awful. He is a very great person. He is marvelous. I don't think so. I'm going to change your mind, so I'm wondering, why did you lead me in here? Huh? A usual program deviation occurred when I first observed. But I, I observed you just after you were brought here. I have brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. I remember in like the original game we would see like the like lightning flashes across the screen and, like this time we got just like the doom the pulse and the static one. Also, an unidentified impulse sped through my processors. These events are new to me. There's more to this phenomenon as well, but I ran diagnostic programs. The solution was, I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. This compulsion has no precedence. Cause unknown. I, perfect computer. I must diagnose this unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wait, did you just say, you want to observe me? Do you know more about me? Function, you must tell me of it. Oh, I can't really because. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. There should be, there should not be anything that I do not understand. Please. Well, you know, maybe. Is it possible that well, you're in love with me? is love. I cannot compute this. Hey, you don't know what love is? Love, how do you explain? Love tells you when you want to be with a person forever. Is this, is this he, I have a dictionary. Let me find this word love. 
makes you feel happy just to see that person happy, smiling, having fun, being free. So, when you love someone, you'll do anything to help when that person is in trouble. Don't you know the saying, if you love something, set it free. Happiness, fun, I have definitions of these words, but my programming is insufficient. There should be nothing I cannot comprehend. I am a perfect computer. Comprehend, love? Love's not something you comprehend, tech. You feel it. Teach. Will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? What? Your computer! Why would you care about love? I am perfect. There must be nothing that I cannot comprehend. Nothing. That's why you must help me understand this thing called love. Please. If you have any wishes I can grant you in exchange, I will grant them. Of course, I'm unable to grant such a wish as letting you escape. I can't believe this! The extra kidnapped me before I could even begin to enjoy my vacation! Oh, that's another different line. Or like in the original she's like, you kidnapped me like common Koopas. Can you come in here and ask me to teach you the meaning of love? I should spit on your screen! Don't get my wishes? Ha! Huh? Why should I believe you? I understand you are angry. That emotion I comprehend. You need not teach me now. I must learn this thing. I must. There's no alternative. I must be a perfect computer. That's why. If you just consider teaching me, I will grant your wishes. Do you understand me, Princess Peach? Now, tell me your wish. Are you sure? Okay, here goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner, the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send wireless mail to anywhere you want. It's 2004. Email is the new hot thing. If you so wish, you can use it right now. It is no trouble. There's a keyboard in front of you. Enter the recipient's address and message. Wait, this keyboard? Alright, let me give this a shot. Okay, it's ready, please. Ted, could you send it? The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return to your room. I'll call you in again, but I want to ask you something. Uh, okay then. Good night. Good night, Princess Beach. And yep, is a big boy. Mighty Koopa King has arrived! Hold your applause, minions. <laughs> now I'm here. Tell me, you crusty old hag! Why did you summon me? The uh, crusty hag, Tammy Koopa, will arrive momentarily. Please, sir, make your minions. Please wait at the rear of the room. Greetings, your puffiness. Hey, Tammy Koopa will be arriving at any moment. Please, your guesses. I've asked you to wait for the movie. Just, yeah, all the different titles about this given. Okay, is that Lord Bowser gazing longingly at a photo of Princess Peach? Uh, I'm gonna put a poke in the mat. Tell you, look at his face when he's booting over that thing. Huh? Yeah! The Lord Bowser! <laughs> well, I'm done here. The rare SCR hilarious story, Mr. Comedian. Do share! Ain't that funny, sir? He's not funny, sir! Aw, <laughs> oh, man, I'm attractive. Every time I look at this, I'm overwhelmed by his coolness. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed like a sticky 
get you all over the place. Yeah. I honestly don't remember that. Oh, I like I'm out the window. Lord Bowser, I've been training day and night to help you conquer the world. I thank you. I shall be ready. Order me as you please, Your Surliness. Are you just upset? Don't stop till even your hammer has abs. Yep, another change in dialogue where originally he called this guy Tubby. But, yep, now we got rid of that part. A picture of me with a mustache on it. <laughs> ah, Lord Bowser! I'm already hating this voice. <sighs> I know it's turn. I can't really start to keep you waiting, my lord. Right, you are, Captain Goobop. Now, out with it. Why did you call me here? Patient happiness. Don't be so patient with your poor servant. Ahem. I just want you to report that Mario, the scum, is off to a town called Loveport. Hi, <laughs> Mario. Every sinner, I don't care what he's doing. I call me every time the guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Yep. As well, you see, my lord, apparently Mario is hunting for an amazing treasure. <laughs> treasure? Yes, Mario has gone in search of star shaped jewels known as the Crystal Stars. Please introduce what they are. No question of their high value. <laughs> star shaped. They sound like good, good world conquering tools. I want them. <laughs> yes, very good. To you researching this for me, you brainiac, you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Leave it to me. Hey, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? Mm -hmm. red do I? <laughs> I love fried eggs, love them, but what a weird question. Why do you ask? <laughs> During my Mario recon, I stopped at a lovely place called Paddle Meadows. Patting on taking everyone there for a picnic, having some eggs and pools. Of course, I wouldn't think of sending out invites if I was asking you for a sword, Bowser. <laughs> Bunkhead! <laughs> Before he called her an airhead. <laughs> a picnic? Get serious. This is no time for fun. <laughs> this is why the evil plans always derail you. You claws always goof off. <laughs> oh, yeah, Lord Bowser! Please calm down! I remember your blood pressure! Princess Peach in Roadport! <laughs> what? <laughs> Tell me your line, Cammy. How? When? Where? Who do you think this thing besides me? I really don't get. I don't have the information quite yet. The investigation is ongoing. I think it will certainly confirm, however, the princess has been kidnapped. <laughs> no secret is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say so. Not stand for this. Ooh, a new pointing emote. I'm going to rope work now. I've got to kidnap her back. I like how he like takes pride, just like, hey, you can't kidnap her. That's my thing. And but your readiness. Wait up. But now yeah, like it's made like a whole bunch of like individual little puff clouds instead of just like a little purple ring. And so we get those little bits every chapter. I will admit, I love Bowser being the comic relief guy. Yes. Another new pose. <laughs> Dude. Imagine just, yeah, like, playing this game and just, like, every time you see a, a new sprite pose, take a shot. Dude, you 
you will be drunk off your ass. Coops, my lad, are you telling me you're going with Mario? Um, okay, that's right, Dad. I already continue traveling with Mario. And I, well, I'm gonna stop. Come back a strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nice to said, young Koops. That's my boy. Always remember this. You're my son, Koops, and I'm your father. That's how biology works. Just me sleep. I'll be right here waiting for you to prove yourself. Um, yeah, just Dad. If anything happens, you can always come home, Koops. Don't you ever forget that. This village will always be your home. Okay, thank you everyone. Well, I'm off! Gotta keep you waiting, Mario. Get up and go else. So, where are we going? Come back to the road port. And Mario? I'll make the map block for a thousand entrance to thousand your door. So as I like the way it leads to the stones of yesterday. Didn't stop there. Please tell me if they should sign and point for the next in line. That's what the book says. Means take a stick of star I found back to thousand your door. Star up there, that magic map. Exactly, come on, let's go! <laughs> Mega Rush Peach. Yeah. Increase attack power by five when your partner has only one HP left. I do like that little change in dialogue. Where in the original, it would say when they're in peril. Which is, it's the same thing, but now it's much more clear about what it means. Classic Mario tune? Something wrong? You're, um, shaking. Are you feeling alright? I <laughs> like how Mario's vibrating and my controller is, too. Uh-huh. Yep. Keep. Yep. SB. My dearest Mario, I send this letter in the hope that it reaches you safely. I'm held against my will into some strange place. I do not know where I am. I remain unharmed and in relative comfort. Those who catch me seem to be after the map I sent you earlier. Maybe help me to use it to find objects they call the Crystal Stars. I do not know what they are planning. I have a feeling it is not anything positive. May be aware that you have the map, so please be very careful. Please, don't worry about me. Princess Peach. Wow, you got mail from a princess. That's so cool! Uh, he said that she's unhurt. That's good, at least. Send those kidnappers looking for the crystal stars. Head back to Roadport. We started and begin to search for the next crystal star. Oh, I think I just now realized something. I need I need to double check something super super quick. just now at this very moment realized oh yeah like the kid in town is talking about yeah like a uh, fire emblem on the game boy advance uh i just realized oh i can get that as a uh, kind of a reference 
because intelligence systems to make Paper Mario also works on Fire Emblem. This is like, oh, so like, I'm only just now getting that. Yep, so we see we got no star points. Still got one from him though. It's like if you yeah get no star points, uh, you still do get a pity star point after a uh, battle is over. So you will always get at least one. Charming Charmer, that is me. Lucky for you, coming here, I grant good fortune. Have no fear. Yep, I can rhyme. I guess I can tell you a tale of days to come, or as well, for luck sits on my spells. What do you say, Mr. Guy? Wanna give it a try? Ready for a taste of power? Okay, so basically... Yes. Uh, you pay her, like, a certain amount of money, and she'll give you, uh... I guess you could call them, uh... Uh, invisible stacks of uh, her spells, which will then wow. randomly occur in battle at, and give, uh, like, random beneficial effects. Like, sometimes an enemy is about to attack you, she'll randomly show up and suddenly you have massively reduced damage. Or sometimes she'll show up after you kill an enemy and suddenly just massively increase the amount of star points they give. Will be Spike Shield Badge, which lets you safely jump on spiky enemies. I think one should be very glad to have before Chapter 6. Because there, in Chapter 6, there's an enemy that flies and is spiky. thing is seeing both of my uh, party members just here instead of just whatever one is currently assigned. Mm -hmm. 
missing the sound effect. Yep. So yeah, like, the first star lit up. That doesn't happen in the original game. Stars only light up on the door when you get all seven and the door opens. Next to the star showed up on the map. But, sorry, I don't have a clue where that is. Uh, I think maybe we should take it to Professor Frankly and let him look at it. But yeah, like the dialogue afterward is yeah, like whoever you have out. I see. Crystal Clip! Uh, can tell us where the Christmas next Crystal Star is or not? <clears throat> the Bogley Woods! The second Crystal Star is inside a great tree there! Great tree in the Bogley Woods, huh? Not those woods. I think some odd creatures live there. And we serve some pipe beneath town that leads into those woods. Uh, Professor Vagley? Probably no. It's not Princess Beach. I got an email from her just recently. Mina said the guys who kidnapped her are also hunting crystal stars. Uh, she said she doesn't even know where she's being held. Yeah. Oh, uh, this peach is. Uh, kidnappers also look for crystal stars. So they help to achieve. For the yeah, treasury? Ah, too many unknowns! Unfortunately, other clues we can rely on are the crystal stars and that power. Oh, yes! Um, that's what we can do is head to Bugly Woods to find that uh, next crystal star. Yes, I recommend you do just that. You gotta fight her for the princess's captors. Whatever their ultimate goal is, it can't be good. Be hasty, if you're low on items or health, trip with the shopping in first. We should to learn more about the crystal stars and the ancient treasure. Yep, there we go. Murphy Mario! Father found in Hooktail's belly. I can even spin! I can still hear it! Yep, my peach. Oh, yep. Thank you for shopping in the Toad Bros Bazaar. We're ready to let you know that the contact lens you ordered is now available to pick up at our shop. So you can uh, still see well enough to read this email. Please stop by at your earliest convenience. Toad Bros Bazaar. Yep. Hey, big brother. Fancy meeting you here. Bada Kawinky Dink. 
Yeah, what am I up to? I'm on an adventure. I have to rescue Princess Declare of the Waffle Kingdom. She has a bad scene, alright. She's been kidnapped by the evil Chestnut King. God, no. I met up with some Waffle Kingdom cabinet members the other day. Pretty intense, bro. You wanna hear what happened? It's a long story. Oh, okay. Yeah, cause like, Luigi's on his own completely separate adventure, and like, everyone is just like, make this like an extra campaign or something. That I'm perfectly fine if not. Okay, so here. Welcome to the home of Merlong, Super Magician. I foresaw your arrival. Hey, you have a wish for three shiny sprites that can power up your partners. Of course, it means they can boost their attack power, but also throw in a new move for free. And also their HP. Yep. They'll pay me three shiny sprites to power up the mellow. See how this has changed. Show Zibi! That's a new sprite. Shazubi! Care to power up more? Yeah, like her HP is now 20. She now has multi bulk. Which is just. Power bounce to rest of the windows. Here. <laughs> Steering the rubber sound the whole way. As they come, we can come to stock, go shop and go for a square. Pedal Metal Speed by Brave Ga Hero. Must have been a tough guy. For Majesty Hercules Castle, I ran into a spiffy mustache fellow. A heart stealing thief. Yeah, this guy. So every time I leave Rogueport and come back, he changes his inventory. Hey, 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 yo! Got a lot of his new products right here. Look no further. Some of these, yeah, are expensive. Jump man. Increase jump attack power by one, but lose your hammer ability. And then, yeah, Mega Rush. <laughs> yep. Yep, contact lens. <laughs> An aid for poor vision. Does Mario really need this? <laughs> <laughs> my trouble, huh, Philip? I had a real hard time finding current shells. You should pick a spy if you can find them, okay? Spy current shells. Counting on you. Give her 
contact lens. Bring the contact lens, Mr. Squishy! Oh, sweet relief, thank you! Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see, oh, I'm so happy! Careful for now on, people don't generally like having their stuff stopped on. Now that I not only do I can go to that side of town, but now oh, it's you again, <laughs> huh, Mr. Stampalot? Oh, no, it's this I mean, I look like a chef. I'm actually quite good. And the ingredients for cookie steals burst to life and culinary magic happens. Can I give up something for you right now? Yep, so she, she can make stuff. I flex my culinary muscles. Oh, keep going. I'll tell us your life, Mr. Bug. Go on, take it, Stompy. Yep, mushroom fries. So, yeah, from just 5 HP to 6 HP and 2 FP. So, that's why I've been picking up things like horsetail and those currently they use. Because, yep. About halfway through the game, I'll be able to find an item. And that, uh, it's a cookbook. I bring it to her and this can use two ingredients. Juice. Juice conditions like poison. Made a mistake. This horse tail by itself doesn't make anything. Actually, I could have gotten a, um, uh, a ho spicy soup from the horse tail, but apparently there's some uh, recipes that like you can make something from a single item, but only after you've gotten the cookbook. So yeah, if I give her the cookbook I get later, then she could make a spicy soup uh, from a horse tail. And also, some recipes have a chance of just failing, and that's 
I didn't have any of those. And I just get a dizzy dial or a peachy peach instead. Recipes I've made. Today's a happy day! Lucky day with the happy lucky lottery! New numbers every day, the lottery is fun and exploding with excitement! Let me tell you more! Happy lucky lottery so special, big numbers, may win each day! Let's buy a lottery ticket here, one at a time! Buy another if you change your mind! Check back later on this board as you use your numbers, come in! For the rest of today's draw, you get a super happy lucky prize! Today's number is drawn each night at midnight! I need to check the board every day. You're never sure to come in eventually. It's at midnight. I mean, according to your clock at home. I think I remember, like, in the original game, uh, uh, like this was like, the like, uh, it didn't like work like randomly. It was like, I think like you literally needed to wait like a year to win or something, or just. It was a ridiculous amount of actual time that needed to pass. So. Mm -hmm. I wonder if they like change that at all. Let's paper. Mario PCYD switch lottery. Midnight, according to the time of the GameCube, winning number generated. Just the GameCube clock forward to allow the player to check number again. However, change the clock backwards to have Lucky accuse the player of cheating. The player admits that they changed the clock. Lucky will have a meltdown and pretend to give the game over. The player does not admit to cheating in, through Lucky's dialogue. He will assume this is just a mistake. Regardless of which choices are selected, the lottery will not restart until Mario pays 500 coins for a lottery pick. Contrary to popular belief, winning numbers are not truly randomly generated. Instead, the GameCube determines which number to show based on how much time has passed since the num purchase of a ticket. Check with 4 to 10 days will receive a 4th place prize, 25 to 35, 3rd place, 85 to 115, your 2nd prize, and 335 to 395 days with 1st place prize. So yeah, a year. And the other day, it was a randomly generated, non-winning number and more than players a consolation prize. Additionally, buying a new ticket will reset the day count. Mm -hmm. That's the GameCube version. Have they changed it? One thing I think it might be 
it looks like it's a similar system to make two different day numbers. Not. I'll wait till there's yeah like a bit more detail about how this whole system works before I pick up a ticket. So we got another item shop. The parlor. So this is the mini game area. Yep. Old brick boy, game boy. And <laughs> the noise. This is the scoreboard. Member's card required for use. <laughs> I am the Beyonce Changer changing machine. I am called Beyonce Changer. I exchange one Beyonce for three coins. How many will you exchange? Yep. So. <laughs> Original uh, Yankee version. These were slot machines, but now they're the yeah Mario uh, three spinning to, to match game. So this is so <laughs> really go above you. This pizza is important work. Even heroes need relaxation. What can I show you? So you have exchange the other tokens you win. Yeah, can't be anywhere else. So we got. Fun some coins used an item in battle, a yes, super peel. I can't, I think I might be able to get this elsewhere, but I'm positive refund is over here. And cake mix, an ingredient. And I do know that as I, I get further in the game, more items will be added to the exchange here. Anything else I can yeah, actively pick up? Now in these areas. Soft and drop their defense. I'm pretty sure that also only works on enemies that have defense. So I can't do it on something with 
uh, like three zero defense and make them just have negative defense. Also, yeah. Once they get the ability to explode things, they can blow this up and they can create like a shortcut. Wow. Expensive shop. Slow and gradual syrups. Yep. Ultra and jam and ultra mushroom jam and jelly. Gold bar and gold bar times three. Really the only purpose of the gold bar is literally to sell them. Yeah, this little uh, bar down here. Wow. It's all the information. Herb tea, please. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> Howdy, my name's Wonky, and I just know stuff. If I know a thing or two, you better believe it. Who knows? Stuff I know may be, even be stuff that can help you. Well, ask me questions. Speak up and ask away. So, yes, yep, information and stuff. He tells you about different kinds of, like, secrets and things. looked at and just like been like disappointed by are like small things they're just like oh they they changed this like one little thing here and there 
No, not that. I know. For me, one of the things that was actually like the disappointed by is when I go to the house near door and um, I hold up a crystal star. When like the thing like goes into the map, there's like this effect where it's just like there's like a, like a ripple on the screen and it just kind of like flakes apart into like panels. You know? Have you seen that? It doesn't do that anymore. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and I beat chapter one. It just said clear. It didn't say end of chapter. It just, oh. it's just like it's just those are the only things I can complain about are like those small things. I don't remember this being here before. I meet a celebrity out here. Oh, I know. Do I make an investment, Mario? I make a living and I'm heading out to dry, dry desert. This is from the first paper, Mario. Prospect for oil. I live my life hoping to get rich quick. Now my chance has come. So the startup was, please lend me some money. No investments, a hundred or more. So much. Won't be better. I will strike oil. But good news. I was about to say I need to be checking for this guy, because a lot of people miss this guy. But yeah, you don't put money in and you will get more money back. I put in 300 coins, so when he comes back later, I'm gonna be getting like 900 coins. When that guy like showed up though, so I'm glad he did because now I don't yeah, have to like worry about making sure I have like enough. Like I can go check out the bad shop. Yeah, I 
I might not be making it into chapter two tonight because I'm doing the troubles. And like, I did that cancellation because, well, yeah, it hurts my money. It will also save me an extra trip to Petalburg. Oh, interesting. We don't, uh, like, that's obviously the hint of follow this guy to progress in the story. Yeah, he's only like, yeah, like in the room uh, outside the black chest where you get paper airplane the first time. Like, like this, now I can. Well. I don't remember how many I need for like eventual all the recipes, so I'll just yeah, we'll just back yeah. So just yeah, talk to the mayor. Yeah, like big block in the one hallway was definitely new. Up. Uh, because I'm quite certain uh, at the block that was now like behind bars, that would usually hold like a gradual syrup to go with the slow shroom. So 
So to be honest, no quest is literally just let him talk. So I'm gonna be trying to mash the buttons and not try to read in his old man voice. Listen to him. Oh, I'm really asleep. But yeah, I'm trying to not. Turtley leaves. Double checked. Uh, yeah, like the guy for the trouble before I started doing them. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> 
Five, you're done. <laughs> you what? You like it? An ultra mushroom. <laughs> yeah, this is immediately going in storage. <laughs> Hide and seek. You have to try to find me. Finding hide and seek champion. Okay, hiding in Hooktail Castle. But if I find him, he'll give me uh, a member's card for the Kianta uh, parlor. So, outside of one very specific thing, th these are like the biggest uh, prizes of uh, the Troubles, are the membership cards. Paper forms. Like the first card I get will be from my first form, the air plane. to come back here a few other times in the future. Back here, yeah. Again, after anyway, when I come back, uh, oh, yep, the spike pouch temporarily does half damage back to all foes who attack directly. Okay, come back with the ground pound to get the star piece here. Come on, art for the chapter. Time after chapter five. 
for another reason. Sure that no one would ever find me here. Master, you see, I love sneaking and hiding so much, I just never stop. It was Abby. I kept hiding. See you now I was known as hide and seek Koopa. Koopu? But it was I thought it was you. We used to be neighbors back when we were barely shell high. Koops, is that you? Yes, Koops, the same Koops who always had it to be it when we played hide and seek. You never found me. Live it once. I can't believe you finally did it. Yeah, I remember back then. That one day you hid, and no one ever found you. I, it's the very day that I decided to come to hide and seek Koopa. It's the day I hid and stuck and stuck and hid my way through life. Yep, that was a big day. It's the time this time. I'll give you what I promise. Yep, special card, the plain mode gang. That was I was traveling and hiding around the world. I don't need it. Well, enough. Time to go look for a new hiding place. Wish me luck. I still got a lot to learn about hiding if you found me, Koops. Nice seeing you again, though. See you later. Oh! I guess it's been long enough she so was just like, Hey, you never had to go forward in the story, right? That just annoys me so much. So let's see, I turn into some of the star pieces I found.
Okay, let's move forward to the story. I frankly mentioned. And then now with my new ability. Here we go. Oh, even like this has got like a little outline. This badge up there. Anything to you, so relax. Tell us what's going on. Okay, this gang of bad guys who kill themselves ex knots came to where I live. He was at a great tree and started tearing it apart and causing trouble. So I came all the way here looking for help. These are bad guys in the great tree. Those are the same bad guys who took a princess and might be in Bogley Woods to find the crystal star. Hmm. You mentioned it. They did say something about some crystal star thingy. We cuties don't know anything about any crystals or stars. Hey, can you guys help us out? Maybe chase them off? If you do, we'll give you a... Uh, oh, look, the crystal star. If you do, we'll have a puny elder give you that. I don't know what it is, but it'll help us claim our tree. I'm sure the elder will agree. What do you say? Let's not waste any more time. I'm begging you. I'm not going to grit this voice at all. Really? You are joking. You'll do it. And then we got a happy emote. Oh, yeah. Just the ball blinking. Um, I guess we should. I feel pretty bad if we didn't do anything. What? We need to get the crystal stars before those X guys do. Oh, thank you so much. This is great. I'm so happy. My name is Punio. Pleased to meet you. Take it where I live. Follow me, okay? It's this way. Wait, hang on a second. I'm sure the beauty always has some button out here open the secret entrance. Aha! Oh, they actually like fall forward. Up, and then we go this way. Damage dodge. Boost defense by one of his Tesla guard action command by Mario. So it effectively reduce increases the effectiveness of guard. Here we go. 
Oh, yeah. Look at this place. Ah, this place is still as visually stunning as ever. So the Bagley wins, huh? Looks so serious, all right. What are we running to next? Um, okay, just a bit farther, and we should be able to see the great tree. And her, fr and her friends are waiting for us there. Oh, my little sister, too. Come on, let's go. New area means new enemies to tattle on. Oh, and also these three. <laughs> Time to go to work, lovelies. Vivian, yeah, you understand what we've got to do, yes? Hey, find a Mario guy and be see on the map of the Crystal Stars, right? We can stay away from Mario and his friends, can we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad things happen all the time, Vivian. You're right about our goals. We should practice. Mario should be coming down this road quite soon. You must, you must ambush him here and get that map. What's that? You're filing over there! Oh, uh, give me this. I found uh, near that tree over there a while back. Maybe the gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely, I just had to pick it up. Yeah, Vivian, for shame, you're picking up someone's scraps. Disgusting! Greedy! It's about that, Vivian, my dear pack rat. I got the sketch of that Mario guy that we got from Grotus. Wee hee hee! What? I I don't have that. You said it's way too important, so you took it. You should have it. Don't be ridiculous. I don't have that thing. You were in charge of it. Let's go bar blame me for somebody. Something you probably screwed up. But I What is it, Marilyn? Huh? What's that? What's that shield, fellow? Sometimes it's not that you great, uh, great. Oh, see if your game's written later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where were you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't tell me you lost our precious sketch. But it doesn't matter. Look, it's not my fault. I never had this sketch. Sorry, you kids! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. I talk back to me like some rebellious child! Yeah, 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 yeah. That the only rationale you understand is force! Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be taking that necklace you just found. Yes, so sorry. Oh, you're horrid. So, yeah, they're here to assassinate Mario, but they don't know who Mario is. Yeah, I gotta check the trees. Also, just. They clink like glass. Ooh, what am I going to do? Good. 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 Because it's one of the most important hidden things in the game. What the really hidden things?
Nirvana. You know about these guys, too. Position. Oh, well, take a look! This door wasn't here before, so I just installed it! Who would put a big electronic door in a tree? Hey, I can't open it! I thought I could finally save everyone! I'm a fool! Oh, pretty no dramatic! Although, this looks thick! What are we gonna do now? a secret entrance somewhere around here. We'll get in that way. Uh, I don't is going to be easy. I mean, it won't be labeled secret entrance. How are you supposed to find a secret entrance? It's secret for a reason, you know. Well, it's hidden by this invisible thingy. You need to find and remove the thingy. Well, but removing a normal thingy sounds tough enough, let alone an invisible one. Uh, oh, got it! Flurry! Surely Madame Fleury's powers can help us? Fleury is a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. It looks like she's a wind spirit who can wield the powers of the air with ease. So you're going with this? She can use wind power to blow the thingy away. The well, more we can try, Fleury lives in the deepest corner of the woods, so let's head back in the direction we came from. Yep. A little bit of color in these woods. Oh, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. 
Building a house here was just the finest idea I ever did have. Oh my yes. This is so different from the bright flash bulbs of the world I'm used to. This peace, this negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. What's even better is that I, Madame Flurry, grow ever more lovely here. Plus, those squishy, adorable little cuties that live in the tree are so nice to me. But if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak. Already I feel the need for drama. That moment of exhilaration when the spotlight shines down on the stage. On me! Surely I was born to be an actress for the ages. seen just like her back. Before we only just saw like the corner of her hair. Instead of then, I shall rise again. But before I make my stage come back, I mean, what's, so we must whip my body and mind into shape. Since I put on some makeup and make my beauty even more beautiful. Wait a moment. Oh, <laughs> winding down. No! we have for today we're hitting three hours and so yeah didn't make a lot of progress in the chapter two but yeah I was taking my time and doing yeah like certain traditions like yeah like getting an entire level's worth of exp on the red bones fight I think I'm gonna try to be a little bit more uh, vigorous with using my uh, abilities here so I can just have reason to use all these FP restoring items. Sorry. Okay. I already know a good place to use the mini Mr. Mini. I already know why this is taking a while to load in, but... <laughs> oh, this is just fun! Hmm. Yeah, but there's also a few star pieces of Pedalberg I need to, like, ground pound. Actually, 
actually, one thing I could check uh, super quick is... So, in the original uh, game, yeah, like, I want to just, like, compare, like, their position to see how many enemies are likely before this to try to guess how many new new bosses. Okay, so the original blooper was number 98 out of 124. So that means there's three, yeah, like new entries before them. And I already found one with the fuzzy horde. So there's two uh Entries left before we get to, uh, yeah, like the boss ones. Really curious where these new enemies will be. But we'll have to wait and see for where they all are. Yeah, so Wednesday we should be able to knock out a good amount of, if not all, of Chapter 2. I do know that this is like the first part of just the game's notorious backtracking, and I'm curious how they'll handle it. Because you gotta go all the way through Bogley Woods to Flurry's house, and she's like, uh, it's probably easy to figure out, oh no, I can't be seen without my necklace! Then I gotta go all the way back to fight, yeah, like, the three shadows. We gotta defeat them, get the necklace, go all the way back to Flurry, Give her the necklace, she joins our party, and then we go all the way back to the tree to actually enter the tree. So yeah, a lot of running back and forth, and I'm curious if we'll be getting any kind of assistance if any of this at all. I'm hoping that there's at least uh, after I get her necklace back, we get a warp to her house kind of like automatic thing. Like, let's go return this to Madame Fleury, and we just immediately are out of her house. I hope we get something like that. But... Until then, this has been Evander Advent. I stream every day here on Twitch starting at 6 o'clock p.m. U.S. Central Time, except for Tuesdays and Thursdays. And join me Wednesday for more Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door Remake on Nintendo Switch. Until then, and everybody. <laughs>